Tonight, a local businessman is taking on the state legislature and fighting for the passage of a proposed bill. Well, the bill would allow hemp to be grown, processed, and sold in Pennsylvania and across the country. Well, right now, that is illegal. Fox 43's Jamie Garland is in Hanover, York County, with more on his belief in the bill. Nine pretzels is what it takes to fill each of these bags. Mary Bailey has it down to a science. She's filling orders for hemp soles. You guessed it, they're made with hemp. And it all started with hemp combining with pretzels. Now, we're making more than pretzels. We're making baklava. We're selling the whole seed by itself. We do soft pretzels and other food products. But to make those products, Sean has to buy the hemp seeds and oil from outside the U.S., usually from Canada. That's because growing, processing, and manufacturing hemp domestically is against the law. All major industrial nations are growing hemp, from everything from car parts to building materials to food products, and we're, we're behind the ball for a little while. Sean is urging state lawmakers to back a proposed House bill that would allow the production of industrial hemp in the U.S. So far, there's been a lack of support, likely because hemp is associated with marijuana. But industrial hemp is not like medicinal. Some people have trouble with it still. I don't. Neither do the thousands who buy these hemp soles. In Hanover, York County, Jamie Garland, Fox 43 News at 10. Owners like Sean say it would be much cheaper to use hemp if it was grown in the U.S. They also say it would be profitable for farmers all across the country.